there, Booksmiths. Welcome back to the channel. I'm back. And today is the three month anniversary of Bite Size Booksmith. I just wanted to walk you guys through some updates as well as discuss the future of the channel. So let's get started. So, as I said, three month anniversary. I can't tell you how honored I am that you're here and that you're supporting me. And I am so excited and I'm even more driven to help you write back. I started this idea for this channel back in, I want to say, October of 2023. And it finally got going in January and it has completely blown my mind. And I am, I'm so grateful for you guys. So thank you so much for being here. Thank you for your comments. Thank you for subscribing, for sharing the channel with other people. Just thank you, thank you, thank you. So let's move on to I'm back. I had no intentions of being gone, but I'm super pumped, super excited to be back. And let's get out there and let's get some books written. An update on Camp NaNoWriMo. I didn't get the space opera serial plotted in time for me to start writing for Camp NaNoWriMo. However, at least I got an idea and they actually ran Camp NaNoWriMo twice a year. So I have plenty of time to get it done, to get the plotting and everything else figured out in time for June. So let me just show you really quick. I haven't done much. You will recall we have the Cosmic Insurgent and here is our original premise. I came up with some character names. You can see over here, I've got a to-do list started, things that needed to happen. I also went into Mid Journey and I created some art uh, as well and just was playing around with some concepts and so all my characters now have some names and I went ahead and I added their names to the premise and that is as far as I've gotten so the next step in this process is actually going to be building the world and then I'm going to be creating additional characters we'll be learning more about our main characters and getting really clear on who the antagonist is going to be in our not only the different seasons of the serial but as well as the first season can't wait to dig into that so we will continue to work on the cosmic insurgents what's coming next so i've been working on what i want to do for the next six months for the bite-sized booksmith because as i said we're going to hit the ground running so I actually put this question out to the people in the Discord group, the Bite Writers Guild, and I said, hey, what do you guys think about me putting together a pre-built codex? And I had some good feedback. So this is a codex like I created for the, the video on the Not Safe for Work GPT. And so it would include tropes. It would include step-by-step -step instructions on how to write or to at least come up with a plan for a book. So that's the, the basic idea there. If you have any questions, if you have any suggestions, please go ahead, give us a comment, and I'll see if I can work that into this codex. The people on my email list are actually going to be the first ones to know about it. So if you want to sign up to become a beta tester, go ahead and you can add your email address there. I don't email like ever. I need to get better at that. So I apologize to the people that are already on my email list. So also I want to put together a up and running with Novel Crafter course. So this is going to be an introductory course on how to go from, hey, I'm signing up for Novel Crafter to inputting your keys to how does the codex work? How do I start putting stuff in there and working with the prompts and then go all the way to actually writing a short story. And I do want to say that the Codex and the Novel Crafter course are going to be completely free in exchange for your email address. I just wanted to put that out there. Let's see. Oh, one other thing I did want to say about going back to the Codex. So right now within Novel Crafter, you're not able to load a Codex. That's not set up yet. It's on the roadmap. I've talked to Space Motion about it multiple times. It's definitely on the roadmap, but it's not there yet. So this gives you an opportunity to have the information already pre-generated and you can copy and paste in to there what you want. On to what's coming up in videos. So where to publish serial fiction and how to make money while you write. I'm super excited about this one. And I actually, 
I put together the Notion document before I disappeared. So I can't wait to present this one for you guys and show you some of the cool tools that are out there for you being able to actually make money while you're writing your books. We'll also continue the series on preparing for Camp NaNoWriMo. That's our space opera serial. I also want to talk about short stories. Space Motion gave me some super duper awesome prompts that we can use to make Novel Crafter work to write short stories. So there's two ways of doing it. And so we can set it up to do that. I also want to show you guys some flash fiction because there's just some days that I just need to pick me up and finishing a project in one day, you might be able to do it with a short story, but you can definitely do it with flash fiction. It also gives you something you can give away to your audience just to keep them engaged. So we'll be talking about flash fiction, building and mailing your your newsletters as an author, having a newsletter, being able to connect directly to the inbox of your reader. That's super powerful. We'll also talk about how to manage perfectionism because that's something that actually came up in the Byte Writers Guild and I said I would talk about it. We're also, I've mentioned, we, we would talk about book covers. I believe we're doing a horror book cover. I have to go back and double check. I also wanted to, I know I talk about tools pretty often and I'll show them just a little bit here, a little bit here, a little bit here, but I really want to do a deep dive into some of the tools that I really like to use, including KD Spy, Autocrit, Publisher Rocket, and Atticus, as well as setting up a serious codex. I've promised to do this in the past. I have yet to do it. I need to do it. Also, how to write good prompts and mega prompts. That is also a request from an amazing viewer like you. And one thing that I've been wanting to do since I created the channel in the first place is build a pen name from scratch and build the website, newsletter, everything. So we are going to do that at some point. Maybe we'll mix that with our serial. Maybe. I don't know. I did create a new pen name to work with the serial idea. So I got to show you what I did. So that was fun. Okay. So just some extras. There have been requests for a YouTube live. I am terrified to do a YouTube live. That's why I haven't done one yet. I also don't have a camera. Yeah, I am a real person. I know that's what a computer would say, but I don't have a camera. I guess I can get one and can do a YouTube live. So if you want a YouTube live, tell me you want a YouTube live. We'll make it happen. Also, I wanted to do some office hours within the White Writers Guild. I need to make that happen. I just haven't had the time to do it. I do sit there and chat with people. Space Motion and Kate from Novel Crafter are both in there. They're always answering questions and saying hi. So be sure to stop by and say hi to them. Also, there has been a request for some people who would like to sit down with me one on one, either to do like a codex consultation or a troubleshooting. I'm trying to figure out how to make that happen. That would not be a free thing. We'll, we'll, we'll figure something out. Also, what have I been reading? So I don't know if you guys know this, but I read like three to 500 books a year. So I'm not sharing with you the fiction that I'm reading because, yeah, there's like way too much of that. But I've just been uh, trying to share with you guys every couple of videos. What am I reading nonfiction right now? So if you're interested, you can check it out. So do me a favor. I'd love to hear what you think of the channel. If you have any questions about writing fiction with AI, if you have any questions with Novel Crafter, I definitely need to do another community Q&A soon. We'll make that happen. But post your questions. Like the video. Subscribe to the channel. You know, I'd really like to have you with us on the next six months. And let's see what happens. I think it'll be amazing. So thanks so much for watching. Thank you so much for being here and I'll talk to you guys next time.